guys welcome to my channel how to learn in this video i want to explain about my java 8 interview experience which i faced in infosys interview few days back let's start with my first question i was given an array and i want to reverse it okay we using java 8 future let me say in stream dot range 1 comma a dot length plus 1 dot map here i want to write logic for reversing this array guys here i want to say a dot length minus i dot to array here i want to assign this result to an array b now let me try to pinch the result here array is dot to string b now let me rerun the application and i will get the reversed array result Okay, now I will explain what I am doing here. So if you observe what this instream dot range will do means it will return a sequential order in stream from in start inclusive to end exclusive. Okay, it means it will exclude the end element and it it will include only first element guys. So I'll uh, get elements from one to four. The reason is it will exclude the end element, right? What is the array length 4 4 plus 1 is 5 as it is excluding 5 i will get 1 2 3 4 here i am writing logic to reverse the array so every time when i get uh, i value initially what is my i value 1 right 1 and a of a dot length minus i means a of 4 minus 1 what is a of 3 a of 3 is nothing but 4 and i am just storing it into an array and i am printing this array here i hope you guys got it let's uh, start with our second question my first second question is I was given a list and I want to separate even numbers and odd numbers here using Java. How I can do it means I can do it using collectors dot partition by let me say collectors dot partition by here I'm trying to separate even numbers and odd numbers. Okay. I'll actually I'll get the result in format of map up boolean comma list of integer here let me say map equal to and when I have the uh, key as true the result uh, I can say the elements in it are 2 4 6 when I have key as false and elements in it are 1 3 5 the logic of uh, uh, I can say keys will be divided based on the predicate here if I say i not equal to 0 then for the boolean key true i'll get uh, 135 and for false i'll get 246 now i'll just try to print the uh, i can say this map and i'll show you here i'll get boolean values in key true right if i reverse the predicate here i'll get the result in reverse way see here i hope you guys got it please subscribe for more videos